So regular insulin, that's 100% bioidentical as the insulin which is produced in the beta cells of the pancreas. Some insulins are modified at the beaching, which shortens the onset peak and duration of regular insulin, also known as short-acting insulin, and turns this regular insulin into rapid-acting insulin. And then you have intermediate and long-acting insulin, which are modified on the A and B chain, which ultimately prolong the onset peak or duration and some of these formulas don't even have a peak. They just act for 24 to 48 hours without a clear peak. They just act continuously. Now these alterations influence how insulins aggregate into hexamers, six insulin molecules that clump together. Atlantis, for example, has a very high likelihood to form insulin hexamers, requires longer to be metabolized, and rapid-acting insulins prefer to stay as insulin monomers, increasing the absorption and shortening the active life.